She is a force behind efforts to raise awareness and research dollars for Alzheimer's disease. A former photographer here at WATE 6 on your side, Rebecca Williams, started off volunteering with the Alzheimer's Association in honor of her grandmother who died of that devastating disease. Well, we enjoyed surprising Rebecca at this morning's Walk to End Alzheimer's Breakfast in tonight's Positively Tennessee. <laughs> Rebecca, good morning, everybody. We hate to interrupt the breakfast, <laughs> but Rebecca always does things to thank everybody else, and we're here to say thank you to her. So thank you for all you do. This is for you. It was a joy to give a little something back to a woman who gives so much to others. First as a volunteer and ambassador for the Alzheimer's Association advocating in Washington, D.C. Then a staff member managing the Walk to End Alzheimer's. Also helping families with resources after their loved one is diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease. She is an inspiration. Uh, after my dad was diagnosed with uh, Alzheimer's about three years ago, Rebecca was one of the first people I talked to here in Knoxville to kind of find out about the resources. Darren Kidwell was so inspired by Rebecca's outreach, he became co-chair of the Walk to End Alzheimer's, an event she has led for several years. I love walk. Um, this year was my sixth walk. Um, I've managed three and it has just grown so very much um, in, in these three years and the community has been fabulous and they've all come together to really rally behind this cause. The woman behind Rebecca's passion, her beloved grandmother, Emma Dell, who she helped care for during her struggle with Alzheimer's disease. Get her lunch and helping to feed her, um, you know, taking her to the bathroom. People don't think about that. It's all those things that you end up having to, to do for your loved one that they can't do anymore. And then on top of that, she didn't remember who I was, which is so hard, especially for an 18, 19, 20 year old um, so you know that stuck with me I don't want to watch another loved one go through this disease and that's why I do this um, to find a cure and I, I really believe that we will in my lifetime wouldn't that be something yes, yes either a cure or perhaps medication to slow the disease uh, I'm so happy to see that Rebecca is optimistic about the future because she has her finger on the pulse of the latest research efforts. She really does. She's so passionate. Yes. We all know Rebecca so very well. Yeah. And, and I know she was also tapped for a statewide position now as well. Yes. Congratulations to her. She's in charge of the longest day. You mm -hmm. know about that event. She's in charge statewide. Wow. So this is a big deal. She said, you know what? My imprint is larger, but I will never forget walk. It'll always be important to me and all the other uh, things about the Alzheimer's Association, which she will still be with. Yes, We're special happy lady, about that. very yes. special lady. To see Rebecca's story and for a link to the Alzheimer's Association, go to WATE.com in the As Seen On section.